Okay, hi. In this video I'm going to show you an idea of mine where the student, to improve himself, can make a screencast of what he's doing. So if he is reading a Linux course or a MOOC, he can uh, take a screencast of, the, uh, of some exercises uh, from the command line. I thought it would be good because then you have to repeat yourself you have to concentrate uh, and you can see the results you see how much errors you made so and I think you maybe if you upload this uh, and you can get some uh, comments on what's what you have done wrong and something like that and get some grading I'm not so good so I will see how this goes Okay, so the idea is that uh, for this uh, exercise I'm going to show you uh, an idea of mine where I add a tag to files, to project files. So if I uh, don't remember where I put the files, I can search the whole hard drive for some tag belonging to that project and I get all the files even if they are in different uh, folders or different hard drives uh, by just searching for a part of the file name that is the tag okay uh, I'm not going to do this in uh, uh, the general commands because I think the syntax for the Linux commands are too difficult to remember I never do uh, so therefore I might do something wrong if I going to repeat that. I'm going to do a simple batch uh, script in Python to do this. Okay. So I have all my files here. The only three files, but it couldn't be 100 files. And then if you have 100 files, then perhaps some files got lost to another folder. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you. I'm going to copy the image file here and I'm going to add a tag two underscores to mo mobile pdf as a description name and uh, pdf and 9 august 2016 and I'm going to use a copy command so this is going to, what I'm going to do. I'm going to add these tags, mobile PDF, PDF 9th August 2016, to all the files using uh, Python and uh, ordinary commands in, in the Linux. So I'm going to start my script. I'm going to import os. I'm going to save this as prod i. So import os. I'm going to open a file. And the file I'm going to open is the directory listing of all the all the my files. There are only three files. But then again, it's going to be more. So I'm going to do the more at sign to get the results stored in the text file. Directory listing for ls. So files text at see that files. Now you see there's something error here. I don't want this, I don't want that. So I'm going to edit out those. Uh, take away this one. Files. This one. So, store it. Control X. See how we store it? Yes. Okay. Now, now I'm going to open that. Files. Next. Open 
I usually uh, use uh, IPython because I don't remember the Python commands either. I can just uh, use IPython in the terminal to quickly browse through the commands. But now read only. Then I'm going to use. Uh, I'm going to read through this file. I'm going to store the results. I'm going to store the split the results. A so name, this extension, extension, line, split, split at point dot at the dot. Then I'm going to remove the extra end of line character. So x extension. Which is the last split? Uh, uh, strip, uh, strip. Then I'm going to print, print, copy. Uh, what well, the same thing I'm, I did here? Copy. First in the string and the name extension and the name and the tag will buy PDF and PDF and nine August two thousand six sixteen uh, dot and the string um, so there's a name and um, extension the name extension so and um, F close so port open read only nine F now I'm going to see if this works. It's just going to print out the copy command line. Python. Alright. So now let's see. Copy image. Uh, looks good. And then we store this in a run script. So this should work. So now you see you have executed all the those uh, list of commands, and now I have this one, this one, and this one. I'm going to move. I created a folder. And the folder name will be mobile PDF. Remove these files. Okay. And I have all, all the files here. The image, the render PDF mobile, render PDF mobile. Hold it here, GPG, GPG. Okay, this was what I'm going to show you. And then you. Oh. Because I made this a lot of times, I, the idea is I, I remember a lot better then. So it's a tip for, for improving yourself when doing these courses. Yeah, this is what I'm gonna show.